In today's video, I'm going to be giving away 7 EVO wall breaker offers. All you need to do to enter is like, comment, and subscribe, and bonus points if you follow the two people on screen on Twitter. Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be playing the best EVO wall breakers log bait deck. If you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And I'm just going to start off here with going wall breakers at the bridge. I do have to put the ice spirit in front, unfortunately, just because this guy does have the cannoneer. I don't know how often you guys face cannoneer, but make sure to be careful of that. If they do have the cannoneer tower, it will full counter wall breakers, so you need to distract it with something in front like skeletons or a spirit. This deck is super fast cycle. I copied it off of another log bait player called Nova Hypno, if you guys know who he is. Um, he always makes these super quick, fast cycle, funny log bait decks, and I copied his here, but I did put in the knight over the Valkyrie, just because I do like the quick cycle that knight has. Valkyrie is really good in this deck too, though. It just helps out a lot against the Goblin Drill, because Goblin Drill is quite popular right now. Okay, I'll just knight here in the middle for the Skelly Drags. I do have Evo Skellies in hand already. The nice part about this deck is that you just get to the Wall Breakers and the Skeletons super, super fast. Okay, I'll Cannon Middle here. I do, need to, I do need to watch out, though. This guy seems to have a strange deck here. Alright, I'll go for the Wall Breakers on the left. Just try to see what he wants to do. Mother Witch, alright. That's kind of annoying, but you can manage around Mother Witch with this deck if you play well. This guy either has E-Giant or Royal Giant. I just have to be very, very safe in single Elixir. I'm going to Wall Breakers behind. Oh, I kind of can't now, but I'm going to do it anyway, just because I want to get to the Evo Wall Breakers. Just because the Evo Wall Breakers are so strong in this deck, and I'll end up taking care of the cannon at least too. I do think it is E-Giant just because of the cannon. I don't know why Royal Giant would run cannon. Okay, I'll just go for the Goblin Barrel here. Just in case he has E-Giant though. I'll put it in the corner. No way it's Royal Giant, right? Okay, I'm going to Princess the back, and then I'll go for the cannon in the middle here. I will need to cycle two cannons if he E-Giants. Wait, what? Okay, then never mind. <laughs> Man, this guy is crazy. All right, I'll just go Evo Skellies here, and then I could try to go for Wall Breakers as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to Evo Wall Breakers right now. Man, this deck cycle is so quick. Oh, he messed up the cannon. Nice. <laughs> That's what we like to see. I'll go for the Skellies Ice Spirit again, and... I don't think I need the cannon, but I'll just do it to be safe. Then I'll fire a spirit here. Very nice defense. That mother, which is going to get a lot of value, but my Evo Skellies might spawn all the way up to the tower because of the cannoneer. Yep, my Skellies are on tower. He had to rage them. Wait, they're spawning again. <laughs> Bro, what is this card? All right, I just need to watch out here. I'm going to Knight and then Wall Breakers. I'm going to go for the Goblin Braille too after the Wall Breakers die. Just don't want to give him arrows value there. Fire spirit too. Nice. I'll go for the second princess. Man, this guy's getting completely destroyed. My fast cycle is just too hard for him to deal with. <laughs> That's why I like this deck as well. You just get a super fast cycle. The only problem is that you don't have any spells in this deck, so you have to be very, very careful and make sure to finish off their towers while you can. He has to arrows, but then I can just outcycle him. Unless the wall breaker connects. Oh, okay. Ice spirit, and then just knight, and then goblin barrel. And this should be a good game here as long as he doesn't catch the goblin barrel. And he doesn't. Let's go. Very nice win. I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm in the next match here against this guy. This guy does play with the Goblin Drill and the Evo Bomber, Evo Skellies. It's just an old deck with the Bandit here. If you guys are old viewers, you guys know that I used to play this deck sometimes back when it ran Rocket. P pretty nice deck now with the new evolutions to the Bomber and the Skeletons. Should work out really, really good in this guy's deck. When I faced him earlier though, he did have the Fireball. I'll just Goblin Barrel here because he wasted the log. And usually when they Fire Spirit push, yup, exactly. Whenever they have Fire Spirit in hand, I like to put it in the front just because you can maybe get some damage if they use the Fire Spirit push trick on the Goblin Barrel. Okay, I'm fine for now, but the only problem is, is that this guy has a lot of Goblin Barrel counters. Evo Skellies and Evo Bomber both full counter a Goblin Barrel. Man, that was kind of a bad Evo Bomber. I just didn't expect that from him. I'm going to Wall Breakers here. See what he wants to do. Ooh, we waste the log again. Okay, he used Fire Spear and the log, so I'll just go Ice Spear, Goblin Barrel, Princess. I want to get aggressive here, just because it's really hard for me to get damage anyways. Okay, I'll just counter that with my Skellies. We'll get a bit of damage, but the cannon was kind of blocking the regular Skeleton's placement. He might go for a Drill Bomber. Drill Bomber is really hard for me to stop because I don't have the log. Yep, here it comes. I'm going to Goblin Barrel. 
Okay, perfect timing though. I'm gonna knight and then I could just cannon on defense. Man! <laughs> the Evo Skelly's full countering the Goblin Barrel. So sad. What doesn't full counter Goblin Barrel these days, man? I feel like Goblin Barrel might need some impact damage or something. I feel like my Goblin Barrel never hits the tower, at least at top ladder. People have just gotten too good at defending the Goblin Barrels. I could Evo Wallbreakers here though and force out the Inferno Tower. Nice. <laughs> it looks so weird that Evo Wallbreakers don't get countered by Log anymore. The evolutions are quite cool, but I feel like they just like take away some of the basic f fundamentals of the game. Okay, you wasted the log again. And there's the Evo Bomber. Man, when is my barrel going to hit the tower? Okay, I'll just go for the Knight on defense again. Then I'm going to need to go for the Fire Spirit too. Unless he doesn't fireball. Okay, I'll activate my King Tower. N nice King Tower activation right there. That's why I don't like Evo Bomber and Log Bait. Just because you can't really give off the King Tower activation too much. Okay, I'm going to Knight Wallbreakers here for us at the Inferno Tower. Wait, he just overspent. Okay. I'm going to go for the Skellies. And now he can't fireball with the drill. That's huge. Ooh, Ice Spirit, please. And evil Wallbreakers for defense. All right, I'm good. <laughs> nice. I'll just Princess the Bridge here. Make him have to defend the Wallbreaker again on the right. Yeah, so the mini one won't connect. Okay, I'm going to Goblin Barrel. Man, not the evil Bomber again. That's another two shots. All right, I'll just evil Skellies on defense. He might Fireball, but it's too late. I'm going to Ignite Wallbreakers here. I'm going to go for the Goblin Barrel right away, too. He has to Inferno Tower, right? He's too late. Princess. And that's good game. Let's go. <laughs> Man, this guy overspent. Drill players just can't control themselves from overspending all the time. All right. I'm in the next match here against this Graveyard player. Man, I really don't like facing this guy. This guy's a menace with the Splash Yard. <laughs> this guy's one of the most frustrating players for me to face because last time I faced him, he literally just completely spell cycled me. He didn't even try to go for any graveyards. He just got Evo Bomber damage and then spell cycled. This time it looks like he's not playing with the Evo Bomber though because he does have the Barbarian Barrel. Usually they replace the Barbarian Barrel with the Evo Bomber. Okay, I'm just going to try to cycle to my Evo Wallbreakers here. I'm gonna Ice Spirit too. And I'll Fire Spirit. Easy defense. I'm just going to go for the Night Wallbreakers at the bridge because he has no Tombstone. It's really hard for them to defend wall breakers when they don't have tombstone. And that's a double connection. Let's go. Whenever they don't have tombstone, you want to go in with your wall breakers. And you have a quicker cycle than them, so that will happen quite often, actually. Just barred barrel. Okay, I need to make sure that I pressure both lanes in this matchup. If I don't pressure both lanes in this matchup, then I'm kind of dead. Because he'll just go for the little prince in the back and I'll, I'll never break through. Um, I think I'm just going to fire spear at the bridge here and get a cheap push. Okay, nice. I can just knight here on defense. And then I could try to Evo Wall Breakers, but the Tombstone's going to pull it, which is frustrating. Evo Wall Breakers completely take out the Tombstone. But, like, even if the Tombstone gets touched a tiny bit, one Wall Breaker will kill it and the other one will connect, which is super nice. Bad Tornado by this guy. He might Graveyard, though, so I have to be careful. I have a really hard time defending Graveyard with this deck because you have no log. Okay, all Skellies for the knight. And then I can Fire Spirit, too. Ooh, he had to overspend with the poison. I could maybe just go for Night Evil Wallbreakers here. I, th I think I'll just Princess the Bridge, though, first and see what he wants to do. I'm going to go Barrel, and then I'll go Knight, and then I'll save my Evil Wallbreakers. I don't want to waste them, man, because they're just so strong. If they connect, they do, like, nearly 2,000 damage, so you never want to, like, mess up with them and always get your connection if you can. Oh, Barrel, too. Now I think it's time to go Evil Wallbreakers. Please, man, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Aw, oh, unfortunate. Wait, it just died. Wait, the one small one. Aw, okay. He's going to Graveyard. I'm going to block the bridge here. You have to. It's the only way to defend. And then I'll Knight here to block the bridge again. And then Skelly's Fire Spirit. Then I'll Wallbreakers on the left. I just need to keep up the pressure. Wow, I'm alive. And the Wallbreakers connected. Perfect. Terrible Knight by him. Maybe I could actually win this matchup somehow. I'll just Evo Skelly's here on top of the Knight. G Goblin Barrel. Man, the, the crazy part is about this is that even if I get him down to like 100 HP, I don't have a way to finish off the tower. So this is really, really bad. I'm going to Knight here. A damage advantage doesn't really mean anything against Graveyard when you don't have a big spell. Okay, I'm going to Wallbreakers on the left here. I know it's going to get pulled anyways, but I just need to take out that Tombstone really badly. Wait, one Wallbreaker? One Wallbreaker? Nice, let's go. I'm going to Fire Spear at the bridge just to apply pressure and Princess Barrel. All right. 
I might be able to make this happen. I'm just going to go for the cannon on defense, ice spirit, then skellies for the graveyard fire spirit too. Nice. Okay, I'm going to barrel. I just need to pressure while defending. Okay, then I have Evo. I'm not Evo Knight, just Knight for the little prince. He has Evo Knight though for my barrel. I could try to wall breakers on the right. Yeah, I just need to keep up the pressure, even if I throw it away into a tombstone. I, I can get one connection though. Nice. That's a ton of damage. I'm going to Princess the Bridge on the right, and now that allows me to go opposite lane again too. He's going to Ice Spirit. He's going to Barbaral. I'm going to Wall Breakers into it. Just need to keep up the pressure. That is one hit unless he... Okay, yeah, he knighted. He doesn't have Barbaral or NATO. I'm going to Princess and then Barrel here. I'm going to go for the Cannon on defense. Th that's going to give me a lot of damage on the left. Okay, he's going to Graveyard for sure. I'm going to go for the Fire Spirit, Ice Spirit, Knight, Skellies. Princess, please. Fire Spirit. Man, I think I might be dead. Okay. I'm barely in this. Princess kind of clutched up there. I just need to keep up the pressure. Wall breakers opposite lane. No, they got pulled. Oh, he wasted the tombstone anyways. Okay. Good for me. I'm just going to cannon here to take out that tombstone. And then I'm going to evil wall breakers on the right. Wait. Does he have anything for this? Wait. Those wall breakers are still going to connect. 150 HP. I need the evil skellies on defense. He has to defend the barrel. And let's go. Tower down. Man, that guy kind of choked that one. I think he should have won. <laughs> I'm in the next match here against this guy. Man, this guy qualified for the 2022 World Finals. This guy's pretty good. Ooh, I could activate my King Tower here, actually. With just the Fire Spirit and the Ice Spirit on the Bandit. And then I could last second cannon. Nice, let's go. Very nice start so far. <laughs> yeah, this guy's not very happy about that. Activating the King Tower early against this deck can just make you automatically win pretty much if you play well. Kill the Skellies and then Fire Spirit for the Miner. In the bats. Perfect. I think he only has zap, so it should be pretty hard for this guy to break through or defend. Oh, wall breakers, just a pressure. Wall breakers are really good against this guy because he doesn't have the cannoneer tower. Okay, I'll just go for my knight. Man, I don't know about you guys, but I, don't, I really don't like facing Mega Knight. I know a lot of you guys like are like a little bit lower than me on ladder and just don't like Mega Knight because it's like over leveled or something, but. I don't like facing it in general, not but it's not because of the Mega Knight itself. It's because of the cards around it, like Prince or like uh, Little Prince, Wall Breakers and stuff like that. I feel like the deck, when you add everything together, is annoying. Okay, I'm going to Knight here, then Fire Spirit. Man, I have a guy in my comments, like, making a tag, like, of every time point when I stutter, trying to say the Little Prince. That guy's, like, been doing it for, like, the, the last 20 days or something, and I'm going to give him another one right there. <laughs> Unfortunate. I do appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me though recently and all those comments like making fun of my little prince stutter is so funny. <laughs> Someone even pointed out that I started saying LP because of the stutter. <laughs> it was so funny. Okay. I did get him to waste his Evo Skellies there though, which is super nice for me. Man, this should just be a really easy win as long as I don't get destroyed by Evo Bats. I'm just going to Princess the back here. And then I'll just go for the knight on that bandit. Oh, wait, I could knight to protect my princess, and then I'll knight. And then I'll cannon, I mean, sorry. Oh, I didn't catch the miner, unfortunately. I'll just skellies here. I usually catch the miner, though. That's what sucks. I'll just princess the bridge with this. Perfect. Nice. Let's go. He didn't even have Evo Bats. He had Evo Wall Breakers. I wasn't even paying attention, man. <laughs> Unfortunate. Okay, I'm just going to Ice Spirit here for the Wall Breakers. And then I'm going to go for the Wall Breakers of my own. He might be okay i'm gonna barrel here he, sh he should be dead right here there's no way he'll defend and break through i'll just go for the knight in the middle okay this is gonna be a hard defense actually okay i'll just go for the fire spirit ice spirit evil wall breakers on defense just cannon in front of my tower evil wall breakers are so good on defense wow that was really good well that should be good game so thank you guys for watching like and subscribe if you enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next video bye